collaboratively with Lucy. Uh, it's a ballad which is in three parts and tells the tale of a shipwreck off the coast of Cornwall in the days just before the First World War. And the crew of the shipwreck were German. These will be available um, afterwards. Crafty plug in there. Um, but very much hope you enjoy this. The instruments that I'm playing are um, quite old. Um, this instrument on which I play part one, because it has a kind of a more, um, more mellow sound, um, I can date precisely to 1927. This one, I don't quite know when it was made, but there is a good chance that it was around uh, during the time. The wreck of the hero. Around the street. 
strand of mast, and the higher the crashing waves rose, the higher the men Wrapped him warm in blankets. 
bits and they thought his body out. They took four more men from the rack and piled them full of rum. They warmed them through and left go rock, bound for the sailor's home. Oh, how the brave men rode and rode, it took them all the day. Going hard with their heavy load to make that grim journey. The Atlantic signal of ocean, it drowns them by the score. But never a night like for this one, six months before the war. Captain, 
fell from his ship and drowned. And where was his poor body buried? Where is his burial mound? Some say his corpse tossed by the tide. Torn by the grim sea, was recovered after a fortnight and shipped home to Germany. Some say that his remains were found. Hinab nach dem Süden, nach dem Norden hinauf, und das Messer fängt er mit den Händen auf, sagten zum Weib die Soldaten. Ach, bitte bereut, wer das Weisenrad scheut, und vom Alte sich nicht lässt beraten. Nur zu hoch nicht hinaus, es geht übel aus, sagte das Weib zum Soldaten. Doch der Soldat mit dem Messer im Gurt lachte er kalt ins Gesicht und ging über die Furt, und was konnte das Wasser ihm schaden? Wenn weiß der Mond über dem Schindeldach steht, kommen wir wieder, nimm's auf ins Gebet, sagten zum Weib die Soldaten. Ihr vergeht wie im Rauch, und die Wärme geht auf, und es wärmten euch nicht seine Taten. Ach, wie schnell geht er rauf, Gott behüte ihn auch, sagte das Weib zum Soldaten. Und der Soldat mit dem Messer am Gurt sank hin mit dem Speer und mit Riss in die Furt, und das Wasser fraß auf, die drin warten. Kühl stand der Mond überm Schindeldach weiß, doch der Soldat trieb hinab mit dem Eis. Und was sagten dem Weib die Soldaten? Er verging wie der Rauch, und die Wärme ging auch, und es wärmten euch nicht seine Taten. Ja, bitte bereut, wer des Weisen Rat scheut, sagte das Weib den Soldaten. The guns that twitch death from barrels milled with exquisite precision, Lewis, Lee Enfield and Mauser, now hibernate in forgotten armories. Shrill whistles with which dispatched us into oblivion are consigned to station platform and playing field. The streaking comets which shed a thousand stars to mark us out for random slaughter by cannon and mortar shell. 
must have found new constellations to dazzle with their brilliance. Even the blood-red generals, willing conscripts too, whose mournful wine kept us company as they carried us to our final destination, are back patrolling their old familiar haunts, all of which strand and Highgate Hill. Some may have returned, but we did not. We stayed behind, formed ranks, a petrified parade, row upon row of white sentinels, straight-backed, our dressing each perfect, and good enough to pass muster by the most fastidious general. Our ghosts, perhaps even our voices, may linger for a while, in Bishop's Palace and Principal's Lodging, in Cotswold Cottage and Liverpool Tenement, but soon they will start to fade and merge, and only the stones will remember who we were. And when I play your violin, slick waves go slack, then suck at your calves. The salt sticks in shock to your hair and you're half overjoyed, but it's daunting. Remembering peace is like opening the can of your childhood and sniffing to check it's not off. You'll have to release the pretension of manhood and see what's gone missing in five years of uniform, tight lips and terror. The water's opaque, but it serves as a mirror of you at 13, all ready for battle. In officer's company, marching like cattle, you like your young self. But then, at the doon, you sliced a man's throat whilst whistling some tune from Nanozzi de Figaro. Now who can tell whom your parents will welcome back home from this hell? It's over, it's over, you mumble. You praise your survival. No need now to groan nor to gaze at the sun and beg to go blind. You'll go back to the park and settle at school and unpack this whole war. Some shyness, some shame will remain. Holding tight to your violin, you'll smother your brain with the polish of Mozart and try to forgive. So you whoop, jump and flounder. You shout, my beloved, I'll be with you Monday. I'll kiss you, we'll live. And you thrash in the sea like a boy rediscovered. Then your Brittany beach bursts in deafening heat by a zeppelin starken outraged by defeat. You burn in the water, you shrivel and burn. A song to dust, one more brother to all. Es ist nun vorbei, ja, es ist vorbei. Und du fliegst zurück in die Heimat der Schande. Deine Brüder sind tot, ja, es ist vorbei. Und du fliegst zurück in den Schoß ihrer Schande. Verdammte Maschine, nun steig! Sie ächst über Meer, also wirfst du es ab, dein Geschoss. Du schaust, wie dein Schmetterling tanzt und zuletzt zerschmettert die Luft, wie ein Held hoch zu Ross seinen Triumph im Wasserstrahl himmelhoch treibt. Hast sie gesehen da unten, die Jungs da? Du schweigst. Es gibt keinen Krieg mehr, es gibt keinen Feind. Sollen danken mir, danken, war nicht bös gemeint. Unser eine ist müde, hat zu viel gesehen, Verdun lasse ich nicht ungeschehen geschehen. Du landest, bist Dreck, dein Land hat verloren, siehst keuchende Weisen zum Hunger geboren. Die Witwe verzweifelt schaut keck zu dir rauf, du stehlst ihr das Silbe, die Demut, den Schlaf. Du irrst und vergisst, wie man liest, wie man lebt und bewundest den Hetze, der wütet und bebt und Vernichtung und Hass in den Biergarten predigt. Du bist der, der willig den Auftrag erledigt und Juden und Sozialisten begräbt. Die Musik verstummt und was du erlebst, erinnert dich stets an den Jungen am Strand. Verstummt, du trinkst, doch es löscht nie den Brand. Des Nachts bist du sanfte, nachdenklich statt feige und heulend im Dunkeln spielst du auf der Geige. And when I play your violin, ich denke an ihn und denke an dich. I'm just going to improvise a short piece from the words of Lieutenant Gordon Carey from the 8th Battalion Rifle Brigade from 1915, which is in the book Forgotten Voices of the Great War, which is the Imperial War Museum memoirs, collection of memoirs. Extraordinary silence.
battalion, the seventh battalion, squeeze down. of those rays that have yet to find shadow. They are rebuffed by blank sand, the hollow face of the sea, running to ground, each seeking a terminus in crumbling dark, the rotten timber of groins sunk in the skein of sea and sand. And what of those sticks placed like a riddle to prop the sky? They stand as a tally, clenched like a set of teeth over the sea. Do they speak nothing but former wonder of how the earth, overlooking all horrors, will ruminate new magic, the sea and land forever coming to terms? forging a settlement in grains of sand. So, please don't be shy about joining in or having a long go. Oh. 
I come and stand at every door Though no one hears my silent tread I knock and yet remain unseen Yeah.